think things like 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 be, behind the icon, um, having the authentic and real conversation, really like highlighting like these stories of of these people who are iconic, right? Like the, the, like a person becomes an image, which is so weird. But it it but to peel that back and actually look at the person that's behind the icon, right? Marilyn for who she is. I think doing that and celebrating that more, valuing like ethics of transparency and vulnerability over like the superficial, you know, um, like glammed up, filtered life. Friend, you know what I mean? Right, which if you want to get glam. Oops. Shoot. We just froze. So, you know, it, it's not like we can take two and, and solve, you know, take two in the morning with a meal and solve all our problems. Um, we have to do real work, right? Like we have to do real work and, and we have to kind of shift the, the, the things that we value, right? We have to value things like transparency and authenticity. This is why I love like behind the icon, this podcast itself is actually going behind the icon, right? People can become iconic in that they are really effectively, effectively reduced to an image or a caricature of themselves. Right. And that's what people look at. That's what people want to be. Right. I've seen how many countless images I've seen of people mimicking Marilyn in the dress over the, you know, like pushing it down or, you know, with the blonde hair and, and all of those things, which is fine. But to look behind that at the person who endured hardships, the person who advocated for others, the person who who spoke up, the person who lived a very complicated life and dealt with mental health struggles and, and got help, right? To, to, to value those things, the ugly things, the things that we don't want anybody to know about, right? The things that make us cry ugly tears to say, hey, let's start to be real with one another, to value that, um, I think is how we begin to shift as a society. It's a very slow shift. Uh, unfortunately, it's a, the, the tide is slow to turn. However, um, little by little, we make you know great progress, right? How do you eat an elephant piece by piece? Right? I mean, I wish I could get up, give a speech and everybody would say, wow, my life has changed forever by it. I get up and speak every week and you know, it's, it almost feels like the things that I say fall on deaf ears, but, but the real work is done in close relationships with one another. Um, and people in positions of influence to, to make choices based on different values say hey i'm gonna choose to make this film or choose to highlight this person or choose to give this opportunity because it may not be monetarily fruitful but the abundance that it will produce is sustainable and it's necessary for us as a people right so say hey i may not make a lot of money but i'll make a lot of a difference and i think that is a hard conversation and a hard thing to do <laughs>